Today we're gonna to talk about how to make cafecito. People often ask me, what is the best brand of cafe guano? And I do have an answer. They have Pilon, they have La Llave, they have many, many others. The best cafe for cafe guano, or for espresso, which is what this is, espresso coffee, the best, best brand is whichever is on special that week. Pretty much it's all the same. So, these are the steps. We have uh, Cuban cafetera. This is roughly um, half a cup. So we're gonna fill it up all the way up to that right there inside. That's about half a cup. I don't know if you can see it. And there has a little button, little thing. You're gonna fill it up all the way up to that. So you can see the water is all the way up to that mark. filter and add the coffee we're gonna get a cup of a coffee maker make it tight not too tight and we are ready to go. So now, the other important utensil, essential utensil to make proper uh, cup of Cuban coffee is that little jar that we have. I'm gonna do three and a half. About three and a half teaspoons of turbinado brown sugar. I'm gonna wait for the first few drops of that Cuban coffee and that's supposed to be the purest form of coffee from our coffee maker. Move it away. I'm gonna get our coffee. Some people do it differently. This is how I do it. I just pour it in. And then you already see the foam. But now we're gonna stir some more so that the sugar gets evenly distributed. See how hot that is. You're gonna be extra fancy. You get your saucer and your cup. You get your um, coffee and you pour it. And if you don't get enough foam, you just grab some with a spoon, and there you have it. You got